Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So it's that time of the week again when Google is rolling out the weekly Chrome security fixes. And these were made available late yesterday in my region. Now to check we have the update, as always, we head up to our main menu, help about Google Chrome. And after the update has been applied, the version and build is sitting on 135.0.7049. Point ninety five or point ninety six other or with version one thirty five means your browser is fully patched on Windows, Mac, and Linux. Now this week we get two security fixes that have rolled out, but just to give you a heads up, one of those is a critical vulnerability, which is your highest ranked vulnerability. Now Google doesn't mention that the critical has been exploited. Um, in the wild so we don't know if it's a zero day they don't mention that but it is your highest ranked vulnerability so check your browsers update sooner than later and the critical is listed as cve 20253619 and it's a heap buffer overflow in codex now just a quick recap as to what a heap buffer overflow vulnerability more or less is all about in case you're unaware heap is a section of memory that stores dynamic variables, also known as a pool or heap of memory segments. Now, there might be instances when software might be too large and then run over these memory blocks. And what happens, then it might overflow into adjacent memory blocks, which can affect the information in those different memory segments, as in the heap of memory segments. And then what happens then is attackers can look to access critical data in those segments and then can take control of the heap overflow vulnerability and allow it to be turned into arbitrary code execution. So I know that's quite a mouthful, but that's more or less what a heap buffer overflow vulnerability is all about. And that's our critical vulnerability that's been patched. And then the high severity is use after free in USB. And use after free, as you may well know, is a common exploit that gets patched almost on a weekly basis. So we can also expect now a Brave, Edge, and Vivaldi to get more or less the same security patches rolling out throughout the rest of this week. Obviously, I'll let you know when that happens. And I have had a quick look around Google Chrome after updating and not noticing any front-facing tweaks or adjustments that have also rolled out with this update. It's just a security fix addressing two vulnerabilities, one of those critical. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.